Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover the divisibility rule for 5. And remember, when we're checking for divisibility, we're checking to see if we can divide without getting a remainder, so the given numbers work out exactly. We have four numbers here that we're going to see if they are divisible by 5, based on the rule at the top of the screen. So if a number ends in a 5 or a 0, it's divisible by 5. So a pretty simple rule here. So let's go through our four um, examples here. Number one, we have 505. So let's see what it ends in. It ends in a 5, therefore that number is divisible by 5. Now number two, we have 767,984. Now that number ends in a 4, therefore that original number of 767,984 is not divisible by 5. Now number 3, we have 92,015. That number ends in a 5, therefore divisible by 5. And lastly, number 4, we have 32,089,300. That number ends in a 0. That means it is divisible by 5. So there you have it. There's the divisibility rule for 5, a pretty simple one. So I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.